What's up, everybody? My name is Coalfire, and welcome to Love is Dead. Now, this has been sitting in my Wuvit accepted queue for quite some time because uh, I accepted it long before the game came out and wasn't allowed to do any videos on it, which is completely fine, but I've been, uh, I've been looking forward to actually trying this out. But from what I understand, it's supposed to be like either a spiritual successor to or parody of, I'm not entirely sure there. I saw her standing there and it's about two lovers who are turned into zombies. Uh, but I should just get into the game and let it explain itself. So let's go. Story mode? I am still, uh, sick. Every time I think I'm getting over it, it comes back with a new vengeance. So apologies for any coughs, wheezes, sniffles, uh, that you might hear during the episode. So let's start a new game. Sing- yeah, yeah, solo. What do you expect from me? Who are you? Uh, him? Is there a red one? Please tell me there's a red one. Yeah, there's a red one. Awesome. That's me. You are a zombie. Who is my lover? Um... What goes... What, I mean, I've got some yellow streaks in my hair, so yeah, let's go yellow. She's a zombie, too. It's cool that they included uh, other pronouns as well. Or at least they and... Kids, I've got a story to share. And I promise, this one's got a happily ever after. It's Aww. a story about how everyone in the world died. And about a family <laughs> so loving, not even the apocalypse could split them up. Now, Aww. these folks and their pets were inseparable. They were always found together. Apple picking together. Roller coasters together. Adrenaline junkies. Uh, <laughs> together. Whole happy family. Incomplete without their pets. Dog face, goodest of dogs. Cat face, eater of bugs. <laughs> Life was good. And then... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. It was less good. Oh, that's hilarious. This ain't a happily ever after. Well, it's not over the yet. Those two died. Whole world turned to zombies. Lucky for our heroes. <laughs> Unlucky for most everyone else. Not that our dead lovers would know. All dead and buried like they were. Now most zombies are simply brainless. But these two, they were just too in love when they died. The pink matter in their brains stayed intact. Usually that stuff goes first. Our newly undead lovers burst forth. Grateful for not being cremated. They found themselves <laughs> not quite alive and not quite together. Oh Where no, were dog the face pets. and cat face? If their pets were zombies, there was only one place they could be. The pet cemetery at the other end of the graveyard. Together, oh, our Lord. lovers set forth into a new and dangerous world. They would find their pets. Holy shit. I was not expecting to be this invested in this game just after the, the opening bit. That was pretty fucking funny. That was pretty funny. Green Meadow Graveyard. So, I think this is a puzzle game. Pause, double, uh, level select, hold? So how do I... Oh, okay. WASD to move our characters. Graveyard 1-1, the littlest graveyard. So I'm not sure what the controls are going to be. Okay, so who am I and try to collect all the pancakes? <laughs> okay, so how do I move around? All right, that seems pretty normal. Do I only have like a specific number of moves or something? Or are we going to be introducing new mechanics and this is just like the tutorial level? <laughs> It was easy to get separated in that huge graveyard. Oh lord. Okay. Um oh I'm over here. Alright. Um can I come over here? 
Yeah, and then we come up here. Okay, we don't fall off if we move while... This is interesting so far. I, uh, I wasn't entirely sure what to expect. Oh, Pupper and Kitter. Oh, shit, okay. Um... So we need to get the, the pancakes and maybe that photo over there? Holding down your move direction is easier than tapping at each step. Oof, funky. Okay. Uh, okay, we got the pancakes. And then we we continue heading over this way. I don't know, I like tapping at each step, for now at least, because it it gives me a better sense of control, especially when we've got a bunch of uh, evil bastards moving around. I'm assuming they're evil. They, they look adorable, Those though. Those two cuties had no idea what they were in for. <laughs> this narration. Balanced breakfast, photographer snapshot. Catching fireflies. <laughs> oh, was that the photo that we unlocked? Oh, man. Okay, so we're two adorable zombies working our way across adorable graveyards to find our adorable zombified pets in the, uh, I'm assuming adorable pet cemetery. <laughs> Alright, in we go. The whole end of the world thing hit pretty hard. Okay, so I'm assuming these skulls are gonna drop out from underneath me. Yeah, but can I stand on top of them? So if I just, like, sit here for a little... Okay, no, I can't. I actually have to move pretty quickly out, for, uh, out from on top of them. Just wanted to check that. Testing the game mechanics, you know? Perfect. We got our pancakes. I love that it's just pancakes. Yeah, stop telling me holding down my move direction is easier. I've decided against that. falling apart. Ah, uh, clever, because the ground's falling out from underneath me. Dirt and stones got mutated and corrupted. Okay, what are the what do the red ones do? Oh shit, everything falls away. Okay. I get you. I do really like how it's introducing mechanics so quickly though. Okay, so we need to make it yeah, quick across. Okay, I don't think that I should Head over on that side, so let's just come over this way. Oh lord! <laughs> wow, that's actually a little more tense than it looks. They all right. Had to learn quick how all the pieces of this world worked. I really like how the it was confusing. Sometimes downright scary. The narration seems uh, pretty related to both the gameplay and the story, and. Uh, I like that it seems pretty clever at this point. Okay, so our our pancakes are over on the right there. So I'm thinking we need to get on this. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. And then I think we need to free this. Okay, cool. And then we can hop on here and free it in this way. So that the next time we head back, we go up again. And it looks like there's another skull up here that we need to get rid of. And then we can hop on here and voila. Maybe not. There we go. I was worried you weren't going to go for a second there, little heart platform. What's up, hun? Fortune. How you doing? Pancakes had never been more plentiful. <laughs> Skulls in the sky, level complete. Oh, I'm liking this so far. Oh, and we we got two this time. Well, let's go. Th let's go to three first. Eyeballs open and shut. Okay, let's. I don't know what that means. New mechanics. New Your eyeballs. Press left click to switch the active lover. 
Oh, weird. So, hold up. What do the eyeballs do? Um, I, I just want to, okay, I can't jump off the edge. So I'm thinking that I need to like stand on this and it'll swap what eyes are active. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we actually have to work together now. That's cool. So far, I'm really liking all the, the little mechanics because it's it's not that complex, but it, uh, it's making good use of, of what's here. Oh, we got pancakes, baby. I'm bringing pancakes. Let's go. Yeah, what's up? I never saw two folks who worked better together. Oh, we're such sweethearts. So many ghosts, they had to be extra careful where they stepped. Oh, Lord. Okay, the the eyeball platform's over there on the right. So, okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. No! Oh, how does a ghost kill a zombie? That's what I want to know. There we go. Made it over just fine. All right, excuse me, squishy eyeballs. I need I need to make a path for my lady friend. Okay, let's go up and away. And oh, I wanna I wanna get the photo. Stay away from me, ghost. No one likes your kind. All right, now that we're over here, we can swap back, come up, swap over. There we go. Okay, I think she's gonna get the pancake this time. Oh, that was close. All right, let's let's move you over here. Yeah, I wanted you to be safe from the ghosty ghost, and up and away we go. Perfect. All right, we're getting there. We're getting real close. And I just completely spaced out jumping onto the platform. Oh, my brain is not working at full capacity. That's fine. Because love overcomes. Love is blind and love is stupid. You ever get that feeling you're being watched? Uh what? Okay, so are these ones like partially broken? Oh, shit. I get you. Oh, poop. Okay, so this, this is gonna be dangerous. This is gonna be really dangerous. Oh, Lord. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, and in you go. So now that I'm over here, do I need to come back? Yeah, I need to come over here and come up this way to smack you. Grab our old guy and then I'm going to bring him up because that's going to be easier. Okay, perfect. Oh, we oh, we overshot it. Ghosted there we go. You know, cuz the ground was literally made of ice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Eyeballs open and shut. Congratulations. Did I miss a photo in the last one? Is there a photo in every single one? Look at us. Look at our kitty and our pupper. Oh man. Okay, I want to go back and do number 4 then. What? Wait a second. Um, do we, do we already get a pet? Is that what's here? Hello? Graveyard 1 Zoo. Zoo in the graveyard? What? Sorry, I have to see this one. The world wasn't all ghosts and zombies. Catch them pancake deer. What? There's pancake deer? Okay, so do I need to like trap these guys? 
Hey, we got one. I got a pancake. Oh, I th I'm starting to think this is a bonus level. Okay, come on. Pancake deer? Yeah, we got you. You know, deers aren't very smart, and pancakes are even less so. So I'm thinking pancake deer are not that smart at all. All right, this one might need the both of us. Yeah, I'm gonna leave you there. And then I'm gonna bring our yellow friend up this way. Yeah, you're just, you're freaking out, Mr. Pancake Deer. Come on. Yeah, we got him. Deal nice, lips. teamwork. I'll tell you later why the world's filled with pancakes. Please do, I'm very curious why we have, uh, I wouldn't necessarily say sentient pancake creatures, but pancake creatures nonetheless. Strange. This is a strange, strange world, but I am, I'm very much okay with that. If, uh, if there were pancake deer out in the forest, I would definitely be a little bit more okay with hunting. Uh, zombies? Zombies! Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's do, like, two more levels. See what's going on. I think that's good length. Lovers were the only nice zombies in these parts. Oh, shit. Okay. So you guys are, like, big patrols. Ah, uh, okay, well. Let's, uh, let's be a little faster this time around. Beautiful. Alright, stay away from me, ghosty ghosts. Not to be ghost racist or anything, but, you know. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Best to avoid all those other undead folk, you know? You know, maybe you're racist. Them other zombies were none too bright, though. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, so... If I... Yeah, if I switch over the platform, they're all gonna be able to move. Okay, are they just gonna jump off the edge? No. Oh no, I need to get the pancake! How do I get the pancake? What? Really? Um... Oh, can I... That's how I get the pancake. I want the pancake. Give, give pancake. That actually sounds really delicious right now. <laughs> okay. Come here, you. Yeah, we got a pancake! Pancakes are the best! Alright. And then we can get you off of there and bring you over. And hello! Nice to see you again, honey. How do we keep getting separated? That's what I wonder. Like, we keep finding each other again. Okay. This doesn't look awful. I could be very, very wrong, though. And a whooshy whoosh. And a douche. Alright. Cool. Oh lord, they they can get on the, the platforms as well. Alright, cool. We got our pancake. Honey, I'm coming! I got How do I how do I how do I restart? I lost my pancake. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Restart level. Yep. It's unacceptable. Completely unacceptable. If uh if I'm gonna be reuniting with my lover again on a moment-to-moment -moment basis, ba -ba -ba basis, um, then pancakes are required. Pancakes are most certainly required. All right, let's let's head down this time. Man, this one that's on the yeah, the one that's on the platform there. He is he's rough to deal with. Ah, okay. Oh, we lived. We lived. Sweet. I, I kind of want to just wait for this... This one to leave. Okay. Okay, we got this. We got this. Yeah. Yeah, what's up, honey? I brought pancakes. Yeah! Power of love. Who did the voice for this? Graveyard 1-4. Zombies? Zombies! Nice. Oh, let's go. 
Let's go. World 5. Push, push, explode? What? Oh, shoot. Looks like we're getting pretty Sometimes close already. You need a bit of elbow grease to push on through. Oh, so if I, like, if I push these things, do they explode? Oh. Why did it say push, push, explode if there are no explosions? Don't mislead me like that. I wanted zombie booms. Okay, I don't think that's an unreasonable wish. Otherwise, this one this one seems pretty pretty straightforward. Is that just a mechanic introduction? We don't have elbows. Careful. Sometimes the world trick if they dove in too fast. Wait, so it's canon that the the zombies don't have elbows, so these are actual representations of the zombies and not just like uh, fictional. Uh, I mean, like these are supposed to be realistic versions of them. They're not like cartoonized or anything. Okay, so I'm thinking I need to come up here and Lady needs to, to grab Pancake. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. I was just going to wait for that to go so I didn't accidentally jump off. All right. There we go. We can head back down. Come on over. These zombies are not that bright. Okay. So we push that onto there. And then Lady Friends can come up here and push that to switch it back so we can have Boy Toy head on up. Okay, this is making me nervous. There we go, perfect, got it. Oh, there's there's a picture, but we're, we're scot-free, so I, uh, I'm just gonna run and grab it, because there's no point in not doing so. Okay, perfect, and what's up, honey? Running or ahead is good. Syrup, I guess. But sometimes they could go right ahead. This place was safe enough. Mm, what? Okay, what's going on? Pancake is up there. How do I get the pancake? What? Pancake? Why? Why are you? up there by your lonesome. Can I, like, get rid of these? Does that make anything else fall away? No? I'm confused! The pancake is beyond my reach, everyone! Okay, uh... Can I... Are these significant in some way? Like if I do that... Maybe? No, I can't push them off the edge. Whoa! 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 What the... What the fuck? What's going on here? Oh... That just opened up the whole level. Except I'm still not sure how to get... Up... <laughs> how do I... How do I get up there? What the fork? Do I need to restart? I think I need to restart the level. Oh lord. Oh lord. Oh, we made it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so this one was about rushing. Okay. The last one was about being patient and not doing the first thing that comes to mind. This one is about getting your ass up there as quickly as you can. Wow. All right. I'm not opposed to the trial and error bits of this so far, but I, I do hope it doesn't become a regular thing. And what's up, hon? Nice to see you again. Oh. Okay, so our our narrator isn't completely trustworthy then. Maybe I'm completely being over-analytical here, but, you know, it's what I do. Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> Just an empty photo. <laughs> so I think 
I'm gonna leave this episode here. I, uh, I am curious to see where else the game goes and see what else is going on, but I hadn't entirely planned on doing uh, a series or multiple episodes on this, but I, uh, I want to hear what you guys have to say about this. If this is something you want to see more of just because of like the story aspects or you think the puzzles are adorable or anything like that, um, I would be more than happy to play some more of this, but I, uh, I want to leave that up to you. I have way too many series going on right now and I don't want to like inundate people with more episodes than they know what to do with of games that maybe they don't want to see. And I know a lot of the stuff I play isn't uh, to everybody's taste, but that's okay. Um, nothing's gonna please anybody or everybody. Nothing's gonna please anybody. Love is dead. Um, but this is really cute. I wasn't expecting such a like story-driven, narrative-based experience. I was expecting more some like goofy captions and uh, zombie jokes, but this uh, this has a hell of a lot of charm and I, I've really enjoyed it so far. But this has been Love is Dead. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Coalfire, and I will see you next time. <laughs>